Hello, it's Game Boy Hero. With me is Metro Xer. And welcome to the finale. Welcome to final battle. Last, the last utopia. It doesn't look much of a utopia. I'm not gonna lie. Well, it is the last utopia. But it's still a utopia, so it should still look good. It's a definition Whatever. of utopia. Whatever. It's the Eggman's like Utopia. Anyway, he has three attacks during this boss fight. This is the Rocket Punch. He uses this more often than any other attack. The second is the Spitting Derogate. Look at him go. Street Fighter moves. Get those frames. Come on, man. Fucking Mirror Hagger. And throw one of my personal favorite, the Chuck and Fuck. <laughs> That's a good name for it. <laughs> oh, God. But the boss is done in less than a minute, so let's give him one last hurrah. I like how he waves his arms around. It's very, very comical. Well, he's in Panda, he just smacked his ship. You don't really see too many comical 2D sprites of Eggman these days. Everything's in 3D. Damn Chuck Jam Kids. Well, that's a lot easier to do. Still, uh, Dibs' 2D animation is actually pretty good. We say as this glorious cutscene emergence of pictures. <laughs> well, it is making the Indeed of Sonic 2. See, look at this. Also, a Leviathan hits Mobius, and now we gotta go to phase. I used this joke before, I don't care, it's a good joke. <laughs> sure. It looks just like a Leviathan. <laughs> well, hey, we beat the game, here's the credits, here's the... Here's the pose. Hooray! We're not done yet, though, the video's only two minutes in. That'd be a really good GIF. Just Eggman laughing. I like that GIF. That would just be a good avatar, really. Yeah, a really good avatar. I can make you one. Uh, Don't, I really I like my current avatar a lot. <laughs> <laughs> Don't right, do right. this. Well, anyway, we says it's for Simmons and the Emerald, but, but which one? The one you're hitting. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we took we just took so long with that, and then it kind of ruined the whole thing. Oops. But yeah. <laughs> You, you, if you just beat Eggman by himself, you get the regular ending. You hit, so you have to beat him while hitting the Emerald first. You have to make sure you don't kill him while you're doing this, otherwise you get the regular ending again and the Emerald just disappears. It's kind of, I mean, it looks tricky because, like, the hitbox, like, it, it just looks like a very finicky uh, thing to do since it's so small and in the back. I can imagine you would accidentally hit Eggman a few times. That hadn't before. I'm actually kind of lucky with this fight because he keeps doing the punch move over and over. Well, you said he does it a lot, so. Yeah, but he does it so often in this fight. I'm kind of shocked here because how he's doing the lever yet, still. Yeah. But like you know, they just said. Duck. Yep. But yeah, once you take the emerald now, you gotta grab it, and then the health is not just at one hit now. Wait, what if you don't grab it? What if you miss it? Ah, uh, he just. It just sits there, I think. Oh, okay. I thought it was like some jerk one time opportunity. They're not that cruel. But yeah, once you hit the emerald, once you take it out of his machine, the helium went ahead and left, so. Be mm -hmm. quick! And that's how you get the last emerald. You don't get it through a special stage, you get it through a boss fight, which is actually pretty nifty. And now you're supersonic with zero rings. This is cheating. Get ready. Yes. Music. That's not 8 bit, but sure, why not? <laughs> yeah, for the fight, I wanted to at least make it a little bit special, so I kind of had to wait to the game audio, replace it with my own. Pass some sound effects, and boom, here we go. Wait, so like, is the shooting sound effect he's doing also something you put in, or. Like art is like everything? Genesis everything. noises? Everything, okay. Everything. Everything. So do you beat this guy? Yeah, you do beat him the same way, got it. <laughs> it's just about to ask. Yeah, he only has one move, or two moves really. But his yeah. main one is shooting the rockets. Three at a time, and shoot at whatever angle you're at. If you're in the middle, oh. straight ahead and well it depends on where he's at and where you're at. Yeah. So, wait, so like how does it determine whether you can reflect back at him? Like you said, it's just the angle? Like, do you have to press, like, a boost button or something? Yeah, there's a boost button here, yes, the FDA button. Okay. And then, uh, 
You see, this the, the way the, the fight actually is very familiar to what you play in uh, the advanced games, because this is where it came from. The one thing I noticed with them, at least for the advanced games in this, was that they do reuse this boss in some way or fashion. But yeah, but this started in Sonic 3, though, like this boss. No, the rockets, they, you know, the rockets you just have to lead them to Eggman, this way you have to Oh, yeah, back. true. Oh, okay, that's the main difference, got it. I like that there isn't, yeah. like, a long, drawn-out, like, meteor sequence, though. I think that was the main, uh, issue. This one That's probably just... That's for cinematic, like, yeah. the idea, because... You, you're going all the way, all of a sudden you start seeing rockets, that's sort of the whole, um, just adds to the atmosphere thing. But I think this one's just a better idea, like, design-wise. Cinematics be damned! <laughs> But yeah, what is this oh, Call of yeah. Duty? Oh please, press X to win. Anyway, he 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 does shoot little balls at you. They did knock you back. The rockets stun you if they hit you, but that's about it. But the only, only way to really fuck it is you just take your time, because they're yeah. playing rings everywhere. Your rings go down kind of significantly slow too. It looks like so. Yeah, it could be. Either, yeah, you lose like one ring per two seconds, so. For one and a half seconds, but anyway, we beat the boss! Hooray! Oh, now he's really in trouble. It kinda looks like Dr. Wily, since it's all like 8 bit ish. I don't know. But that's it, we beat the game, that's all of SVA. Now listen, see if I can enjoy the credits. Are, 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 my, are we expected to talk during the credits too? Yeah, we're fine, man. Don't worry about it. Oh, okay. <laughs> You're still saying things, don't cut off your audio. Got it. Wow, the transition from space to the atmosphere was extremely quick. <laughs> you don't remember how it was in Sonic 3? Sonic well, in Sonic 3 it was a lot more pronounced. Like, you could see a clear division between space and, like, the actual atmosphere. Here, it really blends in really quickly. Oh, there's Knuckles, that's a really weird face. <laughs> Please have you guys and one back. That's a really weird face. And that's it. It's, a, it's about as short as you would expect. Two zones, two acts per zone, etc, etc. I'd like to thank my family for making this game possible. Thank you, family. Thank you, SMK. Thank you. So what did you think? Uh, well, uh, considering <laughs> at the time this was being recorded, I haven't seen, like, I don't know, the last three videos before this, but, uh, <laughs> I mean, so far, it doesn't look bad. I don't, I think, like, if I was a kid and I spent money on this, I'd be like, okay, it, that was fun, and I'll replay it a lot, probably, because this is probably the only game worth playing on the, the handheld, so get the most of what you get. <laughs> I don't know, man, for what it was, it had some pretty good games on it. I mean, it had Metal Slug. Oh, I didn't know that. Is yeah, that also like 8-bit and Tomball? Yeah, because this is what the system was. Yeah, that sounds a little finicky. Well, you, uh, you might just, you, you just look for it and try to enjoy it. But, yeah. With this said and done, I don't think one of my guests who helped me with this LP, but we're not done just yet. One last pose from Sonic is enjoy some English. We'll see you in Sonic Advance. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Sonic games. <laughs>